Mercedes C300 for Maddox board. I'll go ahead and get in it, start it up for you guys. With the aluminum trim. Has 106,787 miles on. Also has the navigation with the screen and all that as well. All right. Has a custom exhaust, the X pipe on it. It's cold out this morning. A little bit of steam. But has the upgraded LED taillights as well. As well as some nice 17 inch wheels. No body damage as you can see. Just in great condition. Back seat for you. You can see clean throughout, no rips or tears or anything like that. And the front seat is clean as well. Also has a sunroof as well. On the driver's door you have the seat controls here, memory for three settings, as well as your power mirrors and every single window is automatic. They all roll down here, including all the way actually, which is kind of uncommon on a lot of cars. A lot of cars only roll on halfway or so, so it rolls down all the way. Um, all the windows do work. Have automatic headlights as well as your controls for the steering wheel on the uh, steering wheel, and then you've got your volume controls and call button, and then the uh, voice commands as well. And then down here you've got your Radio, disc, navigation, telephone, all that, as well as a 6 CD changer. And then you've got your buttons on the side, as well as heated seats. Um, automatic climate control. You've got your shifter down here with comfort or sport mode. And then you've got your little dial here to change things. Uh, very common issue on these cars that these would break. Uh, however, this one has been, has been fixed with the, the metal part. So it will not break again. Um, two good sized cup holders as well as quite a bit of storage space. It's got a ton of stuff in there. But uh, pretty good storage space there, and you just open that with the push of a button right here. It opens on both sides, which is pretty cool. Um, let's see here. This, if you'd like to, you can adjust it by pushing this button to adjust the angles. In order to close it, you just push that button there, and it'll close just like normal. You can still listen to music or anything like that, just kind of neat. If you want it, folds into the dash, gives it kind of a clean look push that open it slides right up so all right I'll just go ahead and turn on the headlights here as well as the fog lights and the hazards for you and you can look at the lights it does have the LED turn signal mirrors you can see a better view from that side right there as well as has the custom HID lights as well as the halogen fog lights. All right. And then on the back, you've got your the, the facelifted version of the uh, LED tail lights. They don't actually flicker in real life. That's just the frame rate of the video. Well, I mean, they do go with the hazards, but as well as some LED lights for the um, license plate. And again, those aren't flickering in real life, just the way the video looks. So, has good tires, good tread depth, uh, and it has a pretty good sounding exhaust as well. So let's go ahead and turn these off here, turn off that, let's do a rev. And then the steering is all smooth, doesn't no groans or anything like that. So, 
All right.